my favorite heckle ever. And I, I just, I mean, I have never, and I'm probably true for you, I've never spoken up in a crowd ever. Never. I've never heckled. Never. There's, there's, there's just no good out of it. But yeah. there's one heckler that I actually loved, and that was we were doing, um, a, we were hosting a New Year's Eve show, and we were in Times Square, and we were throwing it to... Guns N' Roses in Miami, and then throwing it to uh, Sam Kennison. So wow. This is how long ago it was. Mm -hmm. Sam Kennison was in Chicago. And it was actually, it was, I think we were lying about it, but it was recorded earlier. Sure. But still, we threw to it as though he was doing a New Year's Eve show in Chicago. And Sam Kennison was riffing, you know. And his hunk he was doing... Uh, which I'm gonna, I'm not doing him justice, of course, because Sam was brilliant. But he was doing this thing about how we're worried about we have a we have a race with the Russians. We have this race with the Russians. We're always fighting against the Russians, and the Russians couldn't do anything. They couldn't even build tractors. They never beat us technologically at anything. And he's going to this whole thing, which he's building up. Why are we fighting with the Russians? They never beat us at anything. And he takes a breath, and a voice in the audience goes, "Sputnik." <laughs> One word. <laughs> Kennison goes, uh, 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 yeah, 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 they were, Sputnik, they, yeah, they did Sputnik. They get a satellite up before we. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I just thought it was perfect because you can't say I hope you get fucking cancer and right, die. You fucking right. piece of shit. <laughs> just, well, there, there was Sputnik, yeah. Uh, and you know the guy probably had Yuri Gagovich, whatever his name yeah, was, in his good. back pocket <laughs> for first man space. He might have had three of them. You know, Kennison could have been in big fucking trouble. <laughs> but I love the fact that historians make the worst hecklers. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but it was also it was it was great because you know. Kennison, I mean, brilliant, really in control of the crowd, everything perfect, wonderful, you know, just rocking. And this one breath and the perfect one, and the way the guy yelled it just made me, I mean, Teller and I were hysterical. <laughs> if we're listening in the earpiece and watching the monitor, right? So we're just watching this. And, you know, Kennison goes, hey, I haven't been or anything. And then, uh, Spotnik! Crystal clear, perfect enunciation, <laughs> no anger in the voice, loud enough to be picked up, everything. <laughs> Kennison's whole thing he's been built to just kind of goes to, yeah. <laughs> that's a rough one to handle. Yeah. <laughs> that's a torpedo. That's a real torpedo. Yeah, because you're right. You can't tell him to get cancer because he's not being mean. He's just a guy going, yelling, hey, Sputnik, where do you go with that? <laughs> oh, that's a rough one. Oh, yeah. You better hope he's got a fat wife next to him. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs>